Hello, hello. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, depending on where you're at. Welcome back to the Ranch of Rivershine. This is part five of our Let's Play. And got some chill music in the background, kind of keeping us company. So last time I finished, uh, we had just upgraded the stables, so now we can have eight horses. All contestants are invited to participate in the Lumberyard Hurdle Competition. A new intermediate cross-country course is now available in Pine Forest. Registrations are now open at Rivershine's competition board. Before I get started though, I need to do something real quick. Everybody can hear me, okay? Let me just check. Yep, okay. Yep, we are good. All right. We are on summer day four, year one. I didn't get any notices for crops yet. Got some straw over here though. Gail, welcome in. Nice to see you again. So yeah, we've got eight stalls now. We have four horses, so we've got Velvet here still. It's dirty. I just got back from my last walk of the day. Well, that's good timing. It's brush Velvet. here which he's almost done training got 19% left which will probably do some endurance training and speed training we should get one more jump percent but we'll see Indeed, we nipped into seeing the grandparents. We don't see them for a while because they all had a cold and I don't want a cold. Yeah, nobody wants a cold. Should hopefully get Atlas done training the next couple of days. Now you're all snuggled in for the evening. That's good. Okay, so we've got Thunder here. We got last time. And then 
last but not least, we have this mare we haven't named yet. Because I don't know what I want to do with her. She's pretty. Um, I don't know if I want to keep her or not, though. Um, because it's another beginner stat horse. We could really do with a common mare. This one's going to take a lot of training. But I was going to leave it up to you, Abigail, since this was going to be a mare for Atlas. Do you want me to look through the common mares on the auction house to find somebody with better stats? She's pretty, but her stats are painful. They are painful. They are not good, unfortunately. So I'm thinking about selling her and trying to find somebody with some better stats. So we're still training Atlas, then we gotta train Thunder. So it'd be a while before we could even get to her seller and have a look. Okay. We gotta get some money first though. So let's um let's go train Atlas first. Since we're gonna be over in this direction anyway. Go train up his endurance some. Got 19% potential left on him, which I think I'm going to dump most of it into endurance and sprinting. I think we're gonna need probably 11,000 if we want a chance at a good mare. So we got a lot of grinding to do for money. We should get a little bit for um, the mare that we're gonna sell. At least 2,000. Song. It's been a long day without you, my friend. 
Okay, so that got us up to 35% endurance, so then we'll put some in speed and jump. So we'll take him into town. Oh, I can just entrance. Go train his speed up. Some oats. Nope, orchard grass. We'll still pick it up. On their rounds, but I had to upgrade the capture paddock because they were all beginner stats. Yeah, that's next on the list. Gotta start upgrading our pasture or our wild pins. Too fast. Yeah, because all of my pins right now are still beginner, so it's gonna be a minute getting them all upgraded. Let's go ahead and use one of our pairs. You're going to be playing it tonight. <laughs> Definitely a fun game.
This playlist has some interesting songs. Let's go sell tall maple. <laughs> See how much we get for her. Not much. <laughs> She got a little bit. So let's um, let's go do some flex training. Atlas is just gonna go everywhere today. Day working on getting him trained up finally. Yeah, he's exploring the map. Been to Pine Forest, been to Lupine Meadow, now we're going to the mountains. I mean, it should be the Atlas episode. I, I put him in the thumbnail, so. <laughs> Working on getting him trained up, looking for a girlfriend for him. He is a pretty boy. His pretty flaxen hair. place open yet. No! Atlas! We can't train flex yet. Shoot. I keep forgetting. Oops. Wrong button. I keep forgetting. <laughs> we haven't unlocked the flex training place yet. I have it on my other two files, not this one. Well, um, let's go back and train in the arena then. Yeah, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Don't have the flexibility training open yet. Hopefully we get that soon. 
I don't know how long it takes. Splash through the water. Yeah. Okay. Should be able to do intermediate. Leanne, welcome in. Whoops, doing good. Here we go. Do another loop and then see where our jump is at and see if we've gotten a point. And then if we have, then it's time for circles. Oh, it looks like it because I see the area of approvable jump range has widened. See that? Find if the horses snort, they have a point. Yep, we've got a point. And we got a point in speed as well. And we got a point in flex at some point. So we got 7% left. So let's do circles for a little bit. Our favorite. So we haven't unlocked the flexibility training area yet. So we gotta do circles. My cats have the zoomies. a good way to make sure you got some sort of brakes on a horse. There's a point. This is just a training atlas day. It's four o'clock in the afternoon already. Two percent. Got five percent left. You almost finished your Smoky Creams training, so I'm training my Dapple Blue Donovero next. Nice. Looking through the 
glass, finally wrong within a past, knowing we are the you. Caught into a bit inside a war without a base, face it, a bit of the truth. The truth, that's the price you pay. Smoky Cream's name is Darling, and the Dapple Blue Dunnelbear is called Magician. Nice. Those are good names. And Leanne, you're playing Star Stable? I was gonna buy the Belgian Warmbloods when they were on sale a couple weeks ago, and then completely forgot. Star Stables being sued by Sweden. I saw something about that. I saw a video, but I didn't re uh, watch it. So what all is that about? Call the company manipulative towards children and make them manipulate their parents into buying Star Rider and Star Coins and so on. Oh. I mean, probably not wrong. Star Rider is more expensive than most video games. A game should not be for children and it's toxic and all sorts. Yeah. 2% left. Two percent left, we'll put it in endurance. Yeah, that's the video I saw. I didn't watch it, but I saw the thumbnail for it. I need to watch it. trouble with Sweden. Well, guess we'll see what happens there. And you like the music, Leanne? I'm glad you like it. I had to switch playlists because the other one was dropping too many F-bombs for my liking. I mean, I know the channel's not supposed to be, like, kid-friendly, but we do play kid-style games. I don't want a kid coming in here and hearing a bunch of the F-bomb drops over and over again. Maybe wild horses? Might get wild horses. No. 
Saw some signs that wild horses have been roaming in Pine Forest. Thought you might want to have a look. Well, I was getting ready to go train there, so... You guessed it. Yes, you did. The only downside is they're all going to have beginner stats. See if there's any pretty creams or Tobianos. Love me a pretty cream Tobiano. what Lola is on my main file. I've got I got her from the wild and she's a Cremello Tobiano. Pine Forest and five out of the herd was creams of some sort. That's pretty lucky. Go do our training real quick and then we'll go check the wild horses. Don't let me forget to check the wild horses. You like this song too? Yeah, it's a good song. can't be trained any further. We have finished training Atlas finally. Okay, so where are the wild horses? They're way up there.
I hope it's a mare. That's a pretty horse. Let me go see what else is there. You saw Tobiano? Yeah. So we've got that one there, this black one, there's a Palomino, and then the Tobiano back there. Let's grab the Palomino. all of them up now that you have intermediate stats. Yeah, you never know who's going to be the good one. Right now we know everybody's got beginner stats. Stallion's best to round up the ones you like. We'll grab this Tobiano that's up here somewhere. Wherever he ran off to. Hello. Where'd he go? He's going down the hill. Well, there's some corn. Get the corn real quick. That first one we grabbed, I'm pretty sure, is a Carmelo Tobiano, though, so... I'm always a sucker for those. You had one walk itself into the paddock. Nice. We almost did last time, then they turned around. heard in bar one and it walked itself in. Alright. Quick bear. You are a mare. Bay Tobiano. Come over here. Mr. Mr. and Mrs. Palomino. Natural leaf. Mare. Mare. Palomino. That's what I thought. Now look at this gorgeous miss or mister. It might be a golden Cremello Tobiano. Verdict, what say you? Are you gonna be a mare or a stallion? You are a stallion. Don't need this tonight. You go your way, I go mine. 
Yep, Golden Cremello Tobiano. his stats. Stuck on the railing there. Alrighty, let's take a look at Wild Cloud here. Nineteen, thirteen, seven, and twelve. I mean, outside of that jump, it's not terrible for beginner stats. Do I need another beginner is the question. Move him over to the boy's side for now until I figure out what I want to do with him. He's really pretty. Let's take Velvet out and go do the race that we need to win. You think we should keep that? Wild Cloud, or you think we should sell him? <laughs> He's got my favorite color combo, but one of them at least. But do we need another beginner horse? Forest Intermediate Race. Sherry, Sherry, lady, going 
Nice. Got it first try. So now we have to talk to Madeline. Another excellent win to add to your record. I've heard the Lumberyard Hurdle race is quite challenging too. You're really starting to make a name for yourself. And Forever Shine too, of course. <laughs> the closer are we on the statue. Two more in River Shine Town. Right out of me, my mom texts me. <laughs> um, let's have a cucumber. Try and do the lupine intermediate. We always just barely make it on that one. I don't think Atlas can do this race because he's got 5% less speed and endurance than um, Velvet does here. But we have enough money to look at common horses now. I just don't know if we can still or not or if it's over already. Take a look. Wild Cloud can sell for 3500 Let's look at common horses. You are a stallion.
Lots of stallions. I know we can get some strong ones in here that go for like 10,000. Nothing this time. Let's do the one race. We get a race in the town. I don't know why I took that out of Gallop. I never take it out of Gallop. Poor, poor Velvet, their lone mare. Three boys now. Oh, thank God. I've heard from Jai that you recently opened the Trail of Rocky Mountain again. It'll be perfect for flexibility training. I'll tell you more when you're in town. Praise be. We'll take um, 
take Atlas into the town today to do some races. Get him some ribbons. Need a train thunder now. Yeah. We started training him some, so we need to work on his endurance. And you, mister, I don't know what to do with you yet. Dr. River. Did you pick one? I had a phone call. Oh, well, welcome back, Abigail. Um, uh, what did I pick one from the wild horses or from the common horses? I bet you've been waiting for my mail about the flexibility training arena, weren't you? I heard you galloping over here as fast as possible. Well, I'd do the same if I was you. Those training arenas are really useful. This new arena design will help you focus on flexibility by weaving around barrels. I'm sure it'll come in handy for all the twists and turns you have in the cross-country races. I have a look at my shop to build it and even upgrade it later on. Uh, flexibility. Buy that sucker. Yay, we got flexibility training now. And yes, I did pick one from the wild horses. I just don't know if I want to keep it or not. He's a very beautiful golden Cremello Tobiano. But he has 7% jump. <laughs> try um, the intermediate race with him and see how he does. Yeah, he says a little, little number. The others were all in the teens, but yeah, that jump. Uh, 
I could sell them for 3500 But he's so pretty. It's like the same problem I had with the Sabino mare we had. Pretty, but the stats. <laughs> So yeah, barely won the intermediate pine forest race, so I doubt Atlas can do the intermediate uh, lupine meadow race. So it needs more endurance and speed. But we'll get him some ribbons. should have our statue at 100% now. Yeah. Question is, is who do we use 10% potential on? If we use it on Atlas, it'll put him back up with Velvet on par, I think. If we use it on Velvet, she'll be stronger. Like, even stronger. See what common horses they have today. It's rain from spirit. She is pretty. Three of her stats are great. And then that flex. Flaxen Apricot Dun Tobiano. What do you think, Abigail? Do I keep looking? Got 
got 31 speed, 34 endurance, 36 jump, 17 flex, and 58 potential. And we just unlocked the flex training. We did just unlock the flex training. So we could get it caught up. Not much potential. Well, the question becomes then is do we save, do we get a common horse from the auction or do we save our money and upgrade our wild pins to try and get a better intermediate horse in the wild? You would upgrade wild pins more potential. Okay. Alright. We can do that. We'll stop looking. Let's buy some Timothy hay though real quick. Excuse me George. Need some Timothy hay. Anything to sell? I can sell my orchard grass. And some oats. So some of my apples. I got manure to turn into fertilizer. Um, you stay there, Atlas, real quick. I'm gonna go over to Jai. And I'm just curious about the pins. What their costs are again. I kind of want to do the forest or the mountain pin first. Or lake pin. I don't really care as much about the meadow. But these guys are gonna be more expensive. So the most expensive one is 31550 for the mountain pin. Close to the forest. We could save for the forest. Then it'll just be a matter of actually getting the forest to trigger again. So let's go get Velvet and do a couple more races. Get some creams from the forest. I can show you the boy we got. When I get back here. This is the boy we picked. I haven't named him yet because I don't know if I'm keeping him or not. Because of that jump. Your girl looks like him. Yeah, he's a pretty boy. I'm tempted to keep him and try and work on getting a better baby. Need to work on leveling up Thunder though.
I think I'm gonna get the potential on velvet. And go train her jump up real quick. I know I said I was gonna do races, but. I can always get the statue to shine again for others. Just takes 10 races. Got us a 39% jump, 4% left. Need to get one more point and jump. And that'll help us with jumps more. one of our precious pears. Actually, we can use a pumpkin. We'll do the pumpkin. And then we'll do the lupine meadow race again. You're growing a pear tree? Yeah, I'm growing one too. They're so nice, but they take forever to grow. I got six pear trees on uh, my main file. <laughs> I went a bit overboard. I have like 400 pears.
Barely. A bit more like a few trees. Too many. <laughs> yeah, I got two apple trees and six pear trees on my main file. I went a bit overboard on the pears. You just got one of each. Yeah, that's what I'm growing right now in this file. It's just one of each. Um... I'll just do the town again. Easy 1000. We've done quite a bit for the day. percent left. Let's see if we can get a percent on our jump real quick. I'm watching Harry Potter Order of the Phoenix and there one line in the I love and it's Molly Weasley when she says to Fred and George just because you're allowed to use magic does not mean you can whip your wands out for everything. <laughs> Weasley is good. Sirius Black as well and Remus Lupin. They're my fave. They both die. It's painful. Yeah. Spoilers, Abigail. <laughs> I've already seen them all, but you never know who's watching this. It's been a long day without 
We got two percent left. It doesn't really matter where I put the last two percent. from the manure. The movies have been out for 10 years now. If you've not seen them, then you've been under a rock. So let the light you away. No, yeah. Barley will be ready tomorrow. Watermelons in three days. I need to upgrade the crops. Pash or the crop fields as well and get more of those. I like this game, it looks very fun. It is fun. It is very fun. Alright. Oh, perfect time of farmers in town. And Barley's ready to harvest. All contestants are invited to participate in the Twisty Path competition. A new intermediate cross-country course is now available in Rocky Mountain. Registrations are now open. No wild horses. Got some money. And fertilizer. You don't like the intermediate town race? I don't like the expert town race. It is the worst. Can't get past the intermediate town race. Definitely takes a lot of work. It's not easy. The town races are not easy except for the beginner run. If you don't like the racing in the game or you just want to see how the story progresses, there is a story mode option versus normal mode um, that auto completes quests so then you can just play the game but that's up to you stuck in the stupid building. Yeah, you gotta go at a walk around that one corner. Atlas is a clean boy, just three poops. <laughs> I saw a brief glance at the traits that Eloise was thinking about implementing and one of them makes the horse never poop. <laughs> Cloud here had four poops. Oh, five poops. He was a busy boy last night.
I'd be very sus if the horse does not poop, but I'd be sitting it to the vet. <laughs> yeah, you got a blockage. Wild Cloud, what am I gonna do with you? He's got blue eyes too. Okay, so let's take Atlas and he'll try the intermediate race. Atlas, you think you can do this Rocky Mountain Intermediate Race? I don't know if we're gonna make this or not because I accidentally ran out. Mm -hmm. I don't remember what the time limit is. So we have to get 125.
So these times are crazy. They used to be worse. She made them easier. Yeah, I didn't say they were easy. They were just easier than they used to be. <laughs> We will give him a cucumber and try one more time without me running out of stamina. Yeah, she's constantly tweaking the race times. Not gonna make it. <laughs> Not speedy enough. We'll try um, velvet and see what happens. Yeah, he tried his hardest. He's just not, he's not very strong, but that's okay. We're going to find him a girlfriend and they're going to make a baby. That's, that's better. That can carry on Atlas's legacy. Um, What do I need? Get some alfalfa hay. Actually, no, we'll just do more barley. We almost have enough for the intermediate pine forest pin. Let's go plant these real quick.
Okay. Let's do this. We're not starting out with Max Stam because I forgot she was still training up a couple points, but we'll see how she does. Did it. Velvet got it done. Good job, Velvet. Alrighty. Now we gotta go find, actually, let's not look for Madeline. Let's just call her to the auction house. All right, well, the Twisty Path sure Ray surely, I, oh my God, I can't talk. Well, the Twisty Path Ray surely lives up to its name with all those twists and turns. Not enough to stop you though, of course. Here's a little extra for placing first. Alrighty, so we have enough to get the Pine Forest uh, Intermediate pin now. So do we want the forest pin first? We don't have enough for the lake pin, or we can say keep saving for the mountain pin. Did we decide we wanted the forest pin first? Because we want the creams. first but we need an intermediate horse we do need an intermediate horse so let's go ahead and get the forest pin and hope we can get the forest pin to trigger okay
Okay. So we got a little bit of time left in the day. <laughs> Pine Forest Wild Horses, please. Game creams as well. Right. Should we train Thunder up? Is it worth training Thunder up? Let's give him some barley. Go train his endurance. I just don't know if it's worth training him. Because he's going to be about the same as Atlas on stats. Do we need a bunch of beginner level horses? His look. I'm lying on my bed. Why are you standing here in my doorway? What's going on in your head? Forever in my mind. Don't need this to Especially now we upgraded the pins, yeah. That's what we said. Well we'll go trade his endurance and then we'll think about it. I definitely think we need to get some intermediate horses though. So I got us to 30 endurance. You work on jump and flex. Nighty night, everybody. Um, okay, 
Okay, so that one's Crystal Lake. And then the town. So we haven't unlocked the intermediate Crystal Lake or town ones yet. So I didn't brush everybody. Okay, okay, I'll go back and brush everybody. Don't need to brush Wild Cloud. Wild Cloud didn't get out yet today. Don't want any sick courses, I know. Especially when they actually implement the vet. Definitely gotta stay on top of the brushing. Okay. Everybody's brushed. Except for Wild Cloud, but Wild Cloud didn't get out today. Pine Forest. <laughs> Velvet hair is growing out again. You love the long hair on him. Alright. Pine Forest. Pine Forest. Did three circles for luck. It's come to my attention that Galadir's statue has also started glowing in Crystal Lake. I'm sure it will have a similar effect to previous statues, which should help you improve your horse's skill further. Wild horses in Crystal Lake. <laughs> we got wild horses, but not in Pine Forest. Okay, we can go grab one to sell at least. Is my tree grown yet? Yes, it is. We don't want to talk to you, Madeline. <laughs> the apple tree is done. How many days left on you? Six days on the pear tree. Do we keep Wild Cloud? <laughs> I keep going back and forth. I can't really afford to train another beginner horse. Watch there be a really pretty Crystal Lake horse. No! beginner horses not really I don't even really need two but velvet and atlas are kind of canon now and velvet's our starter horse I 
don't understand but the last thing on my mind is to leave you i believe that we're in this together do we trim up her mane and tail or do we leave it long? Since you said you like them long. <laughs> leave it long and luscious. <laughs> Fine, we'll leave hers long. Let's go check the Crystal Lake horses. pretty horse right here. It's got my silver I like. But again, don't need another beginner horse. I saw a Sabino. It had like very minimal Sabino markings. Sabino markings. Looks like a chestnut or bay room. Stormy bear. A stallion. Light bay room. Yeah, he's bay. Then you are a blue, blue room. Or gray room. I think you're blue room though. 
with silver hair, another stallion. Getting a bunch of stallions. Oh, black, I was wrong. Silver black room. Which one do you think goes for more money? Chestnuts have a more orange color to them. I don't know which one fetches more, a Sabino trait or Silver trait? with each other. We'll just take this one, the Sabino, and go sell them. And I think we'll go ahead and sell Wild Cloud. As much as I like his coloring. Yeah, he's got Roni and Sabino on him. Sells for more than Wild Cloud. Ooh, six flex. Yeah, his stats were not good. Four thousand. Forty one hundred for him. Considering his stats, it's not bad. Wild Cloud, I'm sorry, buddy. We need money. That's another 4,000. Thunder. Thunder goes for 5,600. Might see you at a different time, but with better stats. Yeah. Atlas is 15,000. We'll hold on to Thunder. Crystal Lake. Three more. Let's do Lupine first. Get some money. Yeah, this is your baby. Yeah, he's your baby. Oh, 
I like Professor McGonagall out of all the professors. She's amazing. Yeah, I like Professor McGonagall too. She's pretty boss. See if we can do the Crystal Lake race with just as much stamina. to stand up to Snape towards the end of the movies. Forest horses, can we demand our creeps? <laughs> Trying to get money for more intermediate pins. Bridge jumps are painful. I hate the bridge jumps. <sighs> Especially the crystal light jumps, uh, bridge jumps. Those are not fun. They're painful if you fall off. Shut up, Shadow. <laughs>
You can't take them at a gallop. I fail them every time. Even when I canter, sometimes I fail them. Horse games, they are very fun to play. Yes, they are, Liam. Horse games are very fun. Try to beat the time and the stupid bridge jump stops you. Yeah. All right, well, we're getting up there. Over halfway, we got two thirds of the way to the mountain pin. Wait, chickens. Anything worthwhile in the saddlery? The white leather boots. Welcome in Sable. There are certain jumps that are green and I spam space and suddenly it turns yellow and my horse refuses. I'm always like, the heck? I know, right? Every time. And Dave, what are you doing? What's with the? <laughs> Black classic bridle. I'm gonna grab that. Dark brown leather breast collar. Why is it so expensive? Look who the cat dragged in, Day. Bang bang! Yeah. Day, you better not be drunk. White leather boots are 3100. Do we spend money or do we save money? I feel like we need to keep saving our money. Did you say I better not be drunk? Yes, I did. I think Daddy's tucking into bed. <laughs> Getting drunk now just to spite you. Okay. game this is. You wanted to buy it the other night, but you said you didn't have the money right now. You know the one you're playing? I don't know what game you're playing. He's be put to bed. Just a pat on his head night night. <laughs> I refuse. <laughs> you will take head pets if you're tucked in bed and unable to move. <laughs> I 
I feel like this is a kidnapping in process. There's nobody doing anything about it. <laughs> Just accept it. <laughs> Also, if I made a knockoff version of Rival Stars named Enemy Cast Pulse, would you play? Uh, <laughs> probably not. Okay, I think everybody is good now. All right. Pine Forest! Watermelon is ready to harvest. No wild horses again. Watermelon! Shadow knows what I'm gonna say now. Need more seeds. Listen to Plankton from SpongeBob sing this song the other day. Some more hay again. Alrighty, so we need to keep winning races in Crystal Lake. So let's take Atlas out. He hasn't done Crystal Lake yet. I think one more win and we'll have that one uh, statue done. Remember to get seeds and um, plant them. <laughs> Remember to get seeds to plant them. About him not caring. If anything, Zuko cares too much, especially about the people. What is going on? Oh, my playlist ended. <laughs> Let's start it over. Oh, 
was like, why is Airbender playing? Went to the next one on my liked list. Oh my god. Eat these jumps. Oh my god! Atlas! Who is this? You mean the song? Or who was just talking? Before I changed it. <laughs> the song? Um... There you go, Dave. Let me just link the whole playlist. I think it's this. I guess that playlist. Yeah. Yeah. Their voice sounded cute. <laughs> Complete the quest of Madeline Beauchamp. Now, from looking through our competition's records, it seems like Galantir was especially gifted with jumping. I'm sure that his statue will bring you a good enchantment, just like the previous ones. I know our champion would have been proud to share her horse's spirit with you. So we want to take Velvet to Crystal Lake to get the enchant. And it looks like we're close on Lupine Meadow. Cucumber, and then we'll do the beginner lupine meadow race for you.
let's go back and get velvet. We'll go get our seeds. And then do some of the tougher races with velvet. And we need to get um, a jump statue. Go, Atlas, go. He does great with the beginner races. When Atlas has a full name, the full GPS. <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't be joking about names around Abigail Day. She's very particular about names. Let's get some more watermelon. Hello, Aisha. supplies. Alright, let's go get our statue. percent jump for velvet. Now where do you at? 
46% jump. Her flex is lacking, but... Oh, shoot. Let myself run out of stamina. Amber Dream got fifth and six. One more win at Lupine Meadow, and we'll have that statue. So let's. Do a cucumber and redo that race. And then we can get another statue.
never comes without a consequence of course tell me will the stars align will heaven step in will it save us from a sin will it cause this house of mine stand strong that's the price you pay Almost didn't make that one. Yep. Now we can go get the Lupine Meadow statue. So she got 47 speed now and 46 jump. She almost has advanced stats. Because I think 50 is advanced. Except her flex. Flex is lacking. And then I need to work on the endurance. And she's doing pretty good considering she's our starter horse. Boy Sully has even 60 over the board. Nice. Okay. I think we took you out today. Thunder, poor Thunder is getting neglected. Pine Forest. Kill him away through the darkness. Guided by a beating heart. I can't tell where the journey will end, but I know where to start. Mom Pine Forest. We need Pine Forest. Yeah. 
We just needed Leanne to chime in. Saw signs that wild horses have been roaming in Pine Forest. Thanks, Leanne. Scream game. Hopefully we get a pretty one. With good stats. We need the intermediate stats. <laughs> You're welcome. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> We gonna find you a girlfriend or velvet a boyfriend? I thought thunder for velvet, but we'll see what his stats end up as. is lacking in some stats. Thunder is lacking in a lot of stats. But he still has lots of potential left. He's got 26 speed, 30 endurance, 18 jump, 15 flex, and he's got 63 potential left. Alright, Velvet. Let's go look at these horses. Creams and lots of them game. <laughs> Back there again. Be counting stars. Keep the lookout for corn. Tobiano. It's like last time. It's a flax and liver chestnut. Two and the flax and looks nice too. Yeah. We'll round up most of this bunch. Are you a Tobiano? He is. Oh my goodness. I see spots on the butt. Please be good. Yeah, it's a Cremello Tobiano. It's like Lola.
looks like a light green. It's very light. Hello, Tobiano. Yeah, it's a nice black and white. Got some good options. Now we just gotta hope they have good stats. Looking for those intermediate stats. Hopefully all four are intermediate, right? That would be the dream on that Carmelo Tobiano for sure. Flaxen and there's the other cream. So let's grab the flaxen. Other cream and then we'll take a look. Like a Perlino, maybe? Stay here for a minute. Yeah, that's exactly like Lola. It's the same pattern and everything. These two have the same pattern. How about you? You got some cute socks. Wild Cyclone. You're a mare. One intermediate. Yeah, golden perlino. Tall hair. You're a stallion. One intermediate. Not looking good, guys. Natural maple. Mare. Two intermediates. Black silver chestnut. Forever 
Now the one I'm really hopeful for. You. You gonna be all four intermediate for me? Please? Me? Tall Fox. The Stallion. Yep, Carmelo Tobiano. Okay, Simon says. One intermediate. Bummer. Mm. No, I know. Bad luck. Dollar three, except for the flax in us too. take the Cremelo Tobiano and check his stats or do I take the flax and one and sell it? Flax and check stats might be worth breeding if you only have to work on two of the stats. Alright. We'll see what your stats are. Flex is the best one. Endurance is barely intermediate. I think we can do better, guys. We could find better on the common horses. We sell her.
Let's check the common horses real quick. Which can we sell her for? Five thousand. We could sell her, do a race, and unlock another intermediate pin. We could breed Atlas and Velvet and see what they have. but there goes our moneymaker for a week. This one had more potential. I'd almost think that one would be a good one. But it's another stallion. Alright, nothing. I'm gonna sell the flax and because we're really close to opening up the um, intermediate Rocky Mountain pin. Six thousand. Goodness gracious. We can unlock it now. So we can get another pin unlocked. Intermediate mountain pin. Mm. 
So we need 29,000 for the crystal light pin and then we'll get the meadow pin. Now we need to do a couple races. That's her best time yet. Got a secret side in plain sight. When the streets are empty, that's where we run. Every the people do every the things, but I can't be one of them. Um, we you do pine forest races so I can get the endurance statue. out of cucumbers. towards the statue. And then we'll do the town race real quick. Thank you. 
Done with races for the day. Feel bad, I've been neglecting thunder. get out very often. been three hours I'm gonna go out this door and if there's wild horses we'll keep going if there's no wild horses I'm gonna end the stream so I'm tired and I gotta get ready soon for a birthday party tonight let's do the wild horses dance got one circle two circle three circle and see what we get All contestants are invited to participate in the Brook Splash competition. A new intermediate cross country course is now available in Crystal Lake. Alright, no wild horses. So I'm going to call it there. I think we had a pretty productive day. I don't know about you guys. Still looking for partners for our horses though. Um, I'm almost to the point where I'm just thinking about breeding Atlas and Velvet together, but we'll see. Um, we got the intermediate pins upgraded for the Pine Forest and the Mountain Lake and got a lot of money today, which was the goal. So we did pretty good today, I think. So thank you guys for hanging out today. Appreciate each and every one of you. Thanks to everybody that's put in input, Abigail, Leanne, Day, uh, Shadow was here earlier, and Sable was here briefly. I don't know if they were lurking or not, but thank you everybody. If you enjoyed the stream, make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next time. Talking too much about yourself But you should have told me that you were thinking